been in the valley, you ain't been up all The um, campgrounds out here are Prairie Flower Campgrounds at Sailorville Lake, just north of downtown Des Moines. They were pretty full during the weekends, so we could not stay in our site during the weekend, so we had to come to these loops, which they call the overflow. So this area here, there's a bunch of different loops all over here that has people in what they call overflow and uh, people that have a group camping spot. A couple weekends we had to come here and then we go to a spot for the entire week, an actual camping spot, which they're really nice. All right, let's go pick up our granddaughter and go to the Iowa State Fair. You ready? Yes, let's go. We're at the Iowa State Fair today and uh, just got our tickets. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Their uh, printer went bad, oh. so they wrote down <laughs> on a little tiny piece of paper. What is it? Popcorn balls over there, huh? We got the pleasure of bringing our granddaughter Mia with us today. We're gonna have some fun. We're ready. Aren't we, Mia? Yep. All right. One more thing. We always like coming early in the morning because there's hardly anybody here. And, oh, ice cream, ice Mia's like her grandma. She's spotted ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> you can get around, you can get a parking spot a lot easier. This place is going to be jam packed by the end of the day. What did we see? First thing in the mornings every year, Michelle has to get her cinnamon roll, right? Pecan roll. Pecan roll. There they are. Look at them glistening in the light. Into Which the one? Sun. Which one? All of them. You're waiting for me. We're trying to keep up. <laughs> Going in the chicken coop. We got a bunch of stuff in here. We got what do we got in there, Mia? We got a carrot, a green apple, an egg. Let me do this. Okay. We pulled up the tractor. Gave the guy the soybeans so that he can make more fuel for the tractor. Turkeys. <laughs> oh, these little babies are so adorable. Oh, it does. Mm. <laughs> that is not cute or what? I never thought I would say a pig is cute. Oh look! Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. That's we're trying to hit a lot of these things this morning that kids go to because it gets so crowded. It opens up at 7. Some of the buildings don't open till 9. But once it gets past that 9 o'clock, the people just start rolling in. We always try to make it at least one day to the fair. We're going into the agriculture building. This is the time. I'm telling you, this is the time to come see the butter cow. Typically, later in the day, this is going to be jam-packed. On the other side of these ropes here, People will be packed in here trying to see it because they don't want to stand in line waiting to see it up close. So they try to peek over everybody. Oh look, the line is still way down there. Even this early. If you can get this close, I'm not sure why everybody's waiting in line. All of these things are carved out of butter. But that, my friends, is the ever so famous butter cow. Butter cow. Oh my gosh, they carved 
A TV, even. What's that? I think it's 50 years of Sesame Street. <laughs> so, your category is research. Do you like doing research? <laughs> That's a big pumpkin. Those are some big pumpkins. Oh. Wow. What? What are you looking at, anyway? Hello. Now this is just adorable. Oh, I love you. Oh, I love you too. Oh, I love you. Not a bad day, eh? So, uh, how's your day going? Huh? Just hanging around here? Just chilling? Yeah? Okay. Oh, down here? Right there? What you want? Sometimes you just gotta get away. You see Brutus over here? Oh, look at that. Why me? Why me? Geologist Brad Edwards, open the Iowa State Fair and the local five giant tribes. All adults and children, regardless of age, must have their own tickets. Well, that's the show, folks. Thanks for coming. <laughs> How's everybody doing? Yeah, we'd like to welcome all you guys out here today to the 2019 Iowa State Fair. Oh, yeah. Man, this group's ready, huh, buddy? We got a great crowd. And once you got the gator by the tail, <laughs> then you just drag the gator to your neighbor's house, drop him off over there. <laughs> I'm just joking, folks. Ah! Alligators are very agile, and if you grab by the tail, guess what'll happen? That'll happen. He'll turn around, he'll bite you in the hand, or maybe even as high up as your elbow. Very, very quick, very agile to it, he'll strike at it. And that strike is fast enough that if a fish swims by that alligator, he can catch it. <laughs> well, how about if folks, he did it for you? <laughs> Once more, how about a nice big round of applause for a job well done. There's another American alligator. His name is Smoke. He's a little bit different. Obviously, he's white, and that's because Smoke is an albino alligator. We're very fortunate to have an albino alligator since there's less than 100 of them in the world. Less than 100 exist, we got one. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to ban Smoke's mouth, and we're going to ban M Willie's mouth, and then we're going to give you the... <laughs> <laughs> See you, <Marty. laughs> we'll give you the choice as to which gator that you that you hold in your photo. So you got your choice. And our parents are, will you stop it? So this is what they call the varied industries building. And uh, this ain't too bad. Usually you're like toe to toe with people. Tomorrow will be much different. 
Who is that, Michelle? Well, that's Herky. Herky Hawk? Herky Hawk from University of Iowa. Oh, Herky, thanks. What to do in my eight up band picture? Since I come on home, well, my body's very bad. TJ doesn't get out much. <laughs> I am Groot. This is Friday, so it doesn't get really busy on Fridays until after 5 when everybody gets off work. But Saturdays, this whole area is just jam-packed. It's one of the best places to eat at the Iowa State Fair. In our opinion. In our opinion. <laughs> the Rib Shack. This is Southern Style Nachos. And she, instead of the pulled pork sandwich, she just got the pulled pork in a boat. But the food here is really good. Homemade potato chips. Yeah, you get the best bang for your buck here. And the best food of the state fair. Yeah. In our opinion. Because that was it seven and this is six. Yeah. And it's all me. Seven dollars, six dollars. Okay. And it's good. This here is the grandstand where they have the concert on the opposite side, but inside they have a lot of vendors. Our memory serves us correctly. There's ice cream samples right around the inside of this door of the grandstand. Is there? Yes, I see <laughs> it. Oh yeah.
at the fair every year. Peppermint bar. Look how thick it is. It's amazing. Oh, this is called Cast the Colonel for the presidential candidates. Let's see who is in the lead. He's yeah. gonna fix it. He's, he's gonna, gonna fix person, it. But at least he's making some He's gonna fix it. <laughs> Trust him. 2020. 2020. Yeah. day.